What's happening guys, it's Dan from Dremel Tech HQ here and unfortunately for the first time there actually is a problem with my iPhone and I'm sure a lot of you are having the same problem which is why you're on this video and the problem is is that the power button at the top here does not work anymore so when you press it nothing happens when you press it it should go to sleep it should sleep the iPhone and then when you press it when the iPhone is off it should turn it on but both actions aren't working which means unfortunately the power button on the top of the iPhone is broken. Now, of course, there is an obvious fix to it, and that is to go to an iPhone fixer, uh, someone that knows what they're doing, and they will charge you probably around $40, $50 to replace that power button on the top, and it will work like new. But for some people, you either just can't afford that, or you can't get out right now, but you still want to be able to turn your phone off. So right now I'm going to show you a setting that Apple have done so that you can use the power button without it actually working. So it's really simple. Firstly, you're going to want to go into settings up here. Then you want to go to the general tab. And then just around the middle here, there's a tab called accessibility. Then scroll down to the bottom and right here it says assistive touch and you're going to want to press that and turn it on. Now I don't know if you saw what actually happened there when I pressed assistive touch on this thing popped up right here if you can see that and it's kind of like a square about the size of an app icon and this thing is your savior and you're gonna see why. So what you do is, is you tap on that and it opens up some controls and then you have all sorts of things. So say if your home button didn't work, you could also use this uh, for your home button, um, but you can go into device and then you have all of these different options. And the one that we're interested in because our power button unfortunately is broken is lock screen. And there you go, your phone is turned off. And I bet you're really happy to see that black screen because otherwise your phone is just gonna stay on forever. So this assistive touch is going to be everywhere that you go on your iPhone. Even if you go into the camera, you can see it's right there and you can access all the different features right there in any application you want. If you want to turn it off right here, just press lock screen and it's done. So yes, it is a temporary fix, but it's a lot better than not being able to turn your phone off at all. So it is under the assistive touch in settings, and it's that easy. You just press device and then lock screen, and your phone finally can turn off without using the power button. Anyway, guys, I hope you have enjoyed this video today. If you have, remember to give it a thumbs up, and of course, subscribe here at General Tech HQ for lots more Apple videos.